Hey, everybody. My name is Phil Kohler. Andrew Reiner is sitting here to my right. Hey, Phil. This isn't dog football. This is not dog football. You promised me dog football and Jerry Rice. So here's what's interesting about Warhammer Space Marine, which we are going to play for you a little bit right now. This is one of those rare games where, you know, because we're because we're in the print business, uh, a lot of times we have a broken controller. Nope. It's just oh. takes some time to load, apparently. Oh, okay. Uh, sorry. Eat it, orc. Because we're in the print business, a lot of times we get games, you know, ahead of time, fairly early in advance. This is one of those rare games. We didn't really get an advance review copy. Game is out this week, and we just got our retail copy build on the day of release. We got a retail build on the day of release. This is our first time loading it up, so neither of us have played any of this game. Have you played at like a preview event or anything? Nope, never touched it. I've seen it played in passing as yes. I was running by to an appointment. So, uh, yeah, this is fresh. We're Those, doing a fresh take on this game completely. Uh, there's only war. Those are stars, mm -hmm. solar systems. Yep. Little eagly thing. In yeah, the that's the Death there. Star. The eagly thing? No, that. Look oh, at that. that. That's, that's like the, the Death Imperial Star. insignia. Sure. That thing shoots a green laser. That makes sense. Those are mechs from Robocop. Mm -hmm. Ed 2 so this is a 18? RoboCop sequel? Is that right? Prequel? Uh, prequel story? Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. I like Warhammer. I like 40K. Do you actually like Warhammer? Are you a Warhammer fan? Yeah, I do. I, I've been always curious about that interview, but I don't know much about it. Or that, that, that uh, <laughs> universe. I don't know what I'm saying anymore. What are you talking about? I'm dizzy. What is... What's going on? It's a story. Oh, okay. Delay. Unacceptable. These are people tweeting back and forth in the future. <laughs> that actually makes a lot of sense. These are a lot like our tweets, just cryptic and confusing. We need music that builds up like this while we tweet. Yeah. <laughs> Phil, what are you doing tonight? -da! This is the, the future of movies. It's just going to be people tweeting back and forth with dramatic music. That's a painting. That's not real. Okay. Like most video games. Yeah. George Lucas is like, you're still using painting paintings? Like, come on, man. You yeah. Use the computer graphics. It's pretty cool looking, though. Very dramatic. Something bad happened here. Very cinematic. I like this. Toy Headquarters Incorporated presents. Is that the, what that means? Toy I Headquarters? So. Really? Mm-hmm. Wow. Relic Entertainment. Uh, Love those guys. Well known for their previous work with the uh, Warhammer... Dawn of War games. Yep, it was fantastic. Which, which are quite good. And you can get achievements on On, on the second one, yeah. You have entered dramatic airspace. <laughs> That's the music that I want to play the first time <laughs> that I go to the moon. <laughs> Look at this guy. All right. Dude, you got crap on your face. A beefy soldier character. Like you do. Oh, it's Titus. He's a familiar name. Those are Cylons? I think so. They don't you guys are not worried. bracing. They're yeah, not bracing they at, all. at all. <laughs> They're like, this happens every day. That's not how you brace. What is that shot? All right. <laughs> okay. You're going to have back problems? He has a jet pack. Do you know armor. that I wake up every day and I'm just upset that it's 2011 and we still don't have working jet packs? Would you rather have a jet pack or a flying car? Both. We should have both. It's the future right now. We should have both of those things. There's no excuse. Scientists, get on this. See, I think it's possible to have flying cars in, in our society, but then there are like the Dan Reicherts in the world sure. that are horrible drivers that yeah. he won't go on freeways. Yeah, you know, I know this. I know that. It's guys like him who would crash into everyone, blow up houses. Yeah. He's the problem. Sure. I, that's something that I commonly say is that Dan Reichert is the problem. This doesn't seem like a safe way to get down there. Oh, here's some orcs. Who I believe you're going to shoot and or chainsaw. An orc could never use a turret gun. 
And you got a you got a, a sword associated with this game before you got the actual game, right? I did. Sent to us. And it was in the office. It's giant. Oh, here we go. Right into the game. There is a serious like amount of oh okay what the hell x use x oh sorry i'm not reading <laughs> got a lot of orcs it's like killing ewoks i don't feel good about this yeah but they're dumb green jerks i will hit x i will kill all of your family special move clipping oh um, what is going on here i uh, the camera freaked out is that your health bar there? Did he just yell Space Marines? Might I have. stabbed that guy in the face and I enjoyed it very much. Can I squat? No. Yeah. <laughs> it's good that you tried though. It's good that you're you're trying. Uh this is epic. Oh. Yeah, blow that up. Oh, tinnitus. Titus has tinnitus. I see. I see what you did there. Yeah, Your health is awful. low. What do they want me to do? Press Y and then, then B. B. And that regenerates health. What? Just like in real war. I guess you'd feel good about yourself after yeah. doing that. Like, I hit a guy in the face and then I stabbed him in the skull. Yeah. And he died. And then I put a notch on my armor. Hmm. There we go. Excellent. They just want me to keep doing the same thing over and over here. Hey, I was in the middle of something. Oh, I like the design of this thing. Yeah, it kind of has a clockwork kind of manufactured of different things. So one of the things worth talking about this game, it's named Space Marine. Yep. That's that, a, that is a, who I am. It's a real generic name for a video game, huh? Uh, well, it's Warhammer 40K Space Marine. Yes. I just remember when it got announced, lots of people laughing at the fact that not only do we have so many Space Marine games out there, but now we have a game actually named Space Marine. Yeah, do you think there was like some serious focus testing that went on with yeah, that? Yeah, I, like, I would be curious of the story behind that. People like Master Chief. People like Clone Troopers. They like Space Marines. We need to make a game. We need to give them... About Space Marines. Space Marine the game. What's I want to see doing? Space Marine the movie. I'm hoping that happens. I need some health. Nice. Oh, man. Oh, look at my armor. That's pretty Gross. messed up. Remember when I died a bunch in Dead Island? Yes. <laughs> I do remember that. Not happening here. No. But we are actually at the beginning of the game in this one. So the controls so far, I mean, obviously... The comparison I've heard most often of the game is is Gears. Do you feel like this feels like Gears, or is it a little different? It feels nothing like Gears. It's more like really? a God of War, Green Lantern. I guess there's a little bit, there's more <laughs> uh, more melee, definitely. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I haven't taken cover yet. True. Uh, that I is have very a combat roll. Shoot him there. Nice. That's how you do it. I remember the controversy. Uh, I don't remember where this was at, but somebody had posted a preview of this game saying that it was a Gears of War ripoff, and a lot of people got very mad because they said Gears of War actually rips off Warhammer. Ooh, really? I don't see how that's even... I don't, I don't know, dude. This seems like a completely different type of game to me. Yeah. Like, like I said, definitely seems to be more melee, a lot more... Look at this thing. Knifing dudes. Dude, those are those icons from, from Dead Island when you loot. Huh. Okay, I'm rotating a turret, I guess. Oh, <laughs> no. Okay. At least you're not have, being forced to like just tap the button over and over. Do you think after this, this battle, he goes back to his friends and he's like, you're not going to believe what I did. <laughs> I stood in front of this turret that was just shooting aimlessly up in the air, and I pushed it with my hands and shot down the deck. I would. I would go tell and people about that. And they'd be like, that. no, man, you're totally lying. He'd be like, no, I totally did I it. I swear that it happened. <laughs> and I took out the ship. And then I jumped off before it crashed. The ship was oh, this big. Oh, by the way, big. it had a giant skull on the front of it. It was badass. That is a pretty badass ship. Uh, have you checked in on the budget 
approval for getting the giant skull put in front of the building, the GI building. Oh, that'd be amazing. <laughs> we should just start doing that. <laughs> we should. Just painting bricks. See how quickly we get kicked out of this building. Uh, that just reminded me of the Star Wars prequels that crash there. <laughs> Not a good feeling in my mind right now. Yeah, you grimaced a little. Yeah. So I have not died yet. I'm glad for that. Uh, I killed a bunch of these little green guys. Of course you're still alive. You're fine. Don't worry about it. Helmet? Who needs a helmet <laughs> when you're Titus? Oh, boy. <laughs> yep, there it is. <laughs> Late oh. title card. Oh, boy. Um, so it looks very linear. Yeah. Yeah, it does. It's not surprising. Well, I'm goofing on this. I do like this universe a lot. Totally. I, I mean, like, for all my skepticism about this game, it doesn't seem bad so far. No, it's, I'm... And again, like we mentioned... I want to see where it goes. Like we mentioned, uh, fans of Relic as a developer, generally they have done uh, high-quality work. Although, yep. they've not done, like, a third-person action game like this before. They've mostly done... Real time strategy. Uh, the lighting really reminds me of like Dune, the original Dune movie. Okay, I can kind of see that. It's kind of cool, kind yeah. of a good fit for this universe. Um, I have a feeling once I jump down there, things are gonna happen. Aim and fire. Nice. I like that. Uh. Okay. Sucks to be you. Not a bad looking game either. No, no, it does look nice. So far. Uh, let's see if there's, maybe this is a secret. What do you think? Or is this the way I had to go? It well, looks like I a found secret, a, glowy thing. I found a floating Yeah. Eye. Collectibles. One of five. Love me some collectibles. All right, let's get where it doesn't look like he's actually sprinting. He looks like the same speed. A little bit faster. That'd be hard to run with that armor. Man, these guys are easy to kill. I love it. I mean, you're sent I mean, eventually you're going to be running into orcs with actual guns, and then I bet you're going to be taking cover. All right, new weapon. All right. Okay. Didn't have to tell me that. That's the exact same control scheme. Whoa, see? Can you jump into the menus here? I just want to see if there's anything we can uh, figure out. Audio logs, combat controls. Huh. Um, here's my mission One objective. servo skull collected. No back button does nothing. All right. Just wanted to check it out, see if there's any sort of like upgrade system or anything I... special we should know about. Let's see how big this clip is. Okay. That was satisfying. All right. Why are you speaking English? Specifically, why are they speaking English in that accent? So this looks like a, a tailored shooting sequence. Mm -hmm. I could probably kill these guys with my sword, but looks like keeping myself back is probably the best tactic. Let's see how far we can get here. How long do you want to do this, Phil? Let's just keep going. We gotta. It's only been 15 minutes. Let's check out a little bit more. You think anybody's actually watching? I just shot my own guy. If you're watching this... Leave a comment. Let us know. Look, I'm shooting my guy. What should people say happening. in the comments if they're watching us? Um, What's that glowy blue thing? I want, I want you to How get about that. number of deaths in the Dead Island? <laughs> tell Reiner tell us Phil. what happened in another Reiner and Phil to let us know that you're watching this one. <laughs> they're just going to talk about how creepy you are when you come over to my house. That's fine. Listen, this time you invited me over. Although I did promise dog football. Yeah, no dog football here. If you're still watching this right now, leave a comment and let us know if you'd like to see dog football. That's a grenade. There was a glowy blue thing like right in front of you. I want to know what that is. 
There was a grenade, right? Oh, I know what you're saying. Yeah. Yeah, like in Hold front on, of this see. bit of cover here. All right. Did they give me like a cover mechanic and we just... Yeah, I'm kind of curious. Can you... Ooh. Let's see. No, uh -huh. it doesn't look like it. Oh. I did some kind of move. Okay, they want me to get down there and execute, but we should probably kill these guys. There's the blue things behind you now, I think. Yeah, see it? That thing. What is that? Ammo. Excellent. Just what I wanted. There's more over there. How can you not go toward the glowy blue bits? Eat it. I, I like that uh, nice change of pace from Dead Island. I like that you actually have quite a bit of energy here, it seems like. They're definitely playing up the... Uh, Dead Island's just brutal, but I love that it's brutal. Definitely, definitely seem to be playing up the fact that you are a, a total badass in this game. Were you saying I'm not good at the other game? No, no, no. I'm saying in this game, they're playing up the fact that I guess that the character is a total badass is what I'm saying. Like, you can take a lot of, uh, a lot of punishment before you die. So would you say I'm a badass in Dead Island? In Dead Island? Yeah. No, not really. Come on, man. In real life, maybe. Yeah, if we were on an island where there's a zombie outbreak, you would be behind me at all times. Yeah, that's you true. Would be, I would carry using you on you my a, shoulders. Using you as a shield, yes. Through the apocalypse. That's that's really romantic. Ouch. Nice. I don't think that's very nice. Dudes with dudes. The nice thing is, at least they're not talking like the Gears of War guys. That's they're true. They're actually intelligent people. Yeah. But I kind of like that about Gears of War. Yeah, me too. <laughs> I kind of want to play Gears of War 3. It, this kind of feels like its own game. It, right now, it's just kind of it's kind of generic shooting action. The sword play is kind of fun, but sure. I'm not really into the shooting. Yeah. Let's see. Oh, we'll just keep going. So far, kind of so-so. Yeah. Very linear. Uh, nothing wrong with that, of course. Well, this is fun. But yeah, the sword play is definitely the highlight so far. So for people wondering, uh, review will be up soon. It might be up by the time this video goes up. I don't know yeah, how fast I'll get this actually. up. But uh, review will be up soon either way. Um, so we'll know oh, full impressions that. of the game. But I just thought uh thought it would be cool. There's another collectible there. Uh I just thought it would be cool to uh check out a game fresh for once. Yeah, it's it's rare. I think Beastly was one of the few that we did. This is definitely a step above Beastly. Oh man. Well I don't want to discredit Beastly for being a unique gaming experience. That's true. And something I will never, ever something ever forget. Something very special. All right, well, watch the site for the uh, full Space Marine review. We can see how the game shapes up overall. So far, it seems solid, but maybe not great. Correct. We'll see uh, if it opens up. We'll see. Yeah, we'll see. All right, thanks for watching, everybody.